Thank I know you. you will like it. Yes, thank you. Yes. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. How's the soup? It's nice. Mm -hmm. It can only be taste. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's the best around here. Oh, wow. Yeah. Can I help you to water? Mm -hmm. I don't want to drink now. You don't want to drink mm. Are you sure about that? Yeah. Or do you want to drink from mine? <laughs> Please. <laughs> it's alright, sorry. Mm -hmm. It's all right. Thank you. Right. What about meat? No. It's just meat. It doesn't hurt. No, 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 no. There's meat in my food, is it not? Of course I know. But this is special. Thank you. I don't want yours. For someone special like you. <laughs> well, if you say so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are you done? No. I want to watch you eat. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds funny, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I I really wish I could, but I'm sorry I can't. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Adora, it's me. Adora, I'm so sorry. I'm I'm sorry. Yes, she said no to me. Did you ask her why she turned you down? <sighs> she didn't give me the chance to. She ran away from the restaurant almost in tears before I could ask her anything. Yes. Come on, guy. You need to do more. Do more? How? You need to go and talk to her. I'll talk to you later.
Hello, Adora. Hello. Adora, please. I need to talk to someone. Please, can I see you briefly for something very important? <sighs> okay. Where do you want us to meet? Can you come over to my boss's house, please? Is he not around? No. He's not back from his trip yet. What time do you want us to meet? You can come over this afternoon. It's fine. Actually, I don't think I want to leave my mom all by herself. Uh, Adora, Adora, please, please listen to me. Adora, we've known each other for like um, 11 months now, getting to one year. And from the look of things and the little time we'll spend together, I know you care so much about me. Am I correct? Yeah, I really do care about you, Abina. Why then did you turn down my proposal? Or you don't fancy me good enough to spend the rest of your life with me? I do. You do? Yes. Or was the proposal too soon? No, it's, it's not that. Then what? Anyways, please, can I come over to the house to see you? Yes, please. I was going to suggest that. Let's talk about this when you come. Fine. I'll see you soon then. Okay. about the bush. She has to leave. You cannot kill my brother and possess her. There is protection. Why are you not calm down? Why are you not calm down? No, sir. That's who you are. My Lord. Don't call me your in-law. My in-law. I am not your in-law. You are an evil woman. A murderer. That's his target. My stand is that she must live with this house with her children. She has to leave. You cannot kill my brother and possess his protection. You killed my son. I did not kill you. Child She's still lying. She's still lying. I want you to go. I did not kill my husband. I did not kill him. You know why I hate you? You lie too much. You lie too much. Oh, wow. You shop. Don't call me your uncle. I'm not your uncle. Are you, are you stupid? Evil show. You slept with another man. What? You are the gods. My mother won't kill my brother. Did I not confront you? Nam. What are you saying? I'm not lying. She knows. I'm saying the truth. Let's find the fact that my brother loved you so much. You can't go by killing. Ah, God. Calm down. We can resolve this. We cannot resolve this. It's the end. Ah. My wife, you can't do I did not kill my husband. I did not kill him. You know why I hate you? You killed my son. I don't know why you did it. You killed my son. Mature, mature. You know I'm saying the truth. You know. I don't know. I don't know. You fool woman. Mama, she must leave this house. If you call me your angel again, I'll pluck out your eyes. Don't just try it again. Don't. 
<laughs> so you killed my son. Who is this man that she has been sleeping with? Martina Bell. Martina Bell, that man that requires uh, eyeglasses. She doesn't know I have a witness. I, I came prepared. I came prepared. I brought out this issue thinking she will admit it. But yes, she's lying. No problem. The stupid tears will not move me. I have taken a decision, Mama. It is my brother's house. She must leave. You cannot kill my brother and live in our house. Mama, you support me. You cannot stop it. The evidence is glaring. I have evidence. Okay, Mama, Mama let me now spill the whole thing. Calm down. Come, come, come. Please come inside. Come. Walk fast, walk fast. Come. <laughs> if, if we show. God bless you. Mama, God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mama, this is Chide Berry. You know him. What is this I'm hearing? <laughs> is it true what is going on between you and my son's wife? Yes. Hey! Not Genti, silence, Genti. Ma, I'm not proud of what I'm doing because I know that it's against it. I'm not happy at all seeing myself sleeping with another man's wife. Hey! I don't know what I was thinking. But the moment Anand found out, he confronted me. Mm -hmm. I immediately ran to her and told her that we need to stop. But she refused. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? But I insisted that we we have to stop. Not until she made one comment. What did she tell you? She said. What did she say to you? She said, will I continue this affair if Mr. Carlo died? Ah! I, I I insisted that I will not continue. I walked away from her. Two weeks later, Mr. Carlo died. as a woman of truth. I must say that I am very happy that you stood by me to chase out that devil. It would have been disastrous if we had left she and her daughters here. She might end up killing me or even you. 
but we shouldn't have chased your nieces away. Mama, don't go there. I don't like when you talk like this. What do you mean? They're not guilty of their mother's crime. Mama, I don't like when you talk like this. You can't chase their mother away and leave them behind. She will be using them to manipulate things. Yeah. They are girls. They will soon get married to other men and build other men's homes. Okay? We can't continue to keep them here. It will be very risky. Women should not be allowed to own property. Now that they are gone, uh -huh. I will take care of my brother's property, Mama. I will manage it. Nand. Again. I'm not against your taking over your brother's property. Thank you. But make sure your addiction for gambling does not push you to sell off the property. Mama, you have started again. That's my problem with you. Mbana. You always talk as if I'm a child. What do you mean my addiction to, to, to gambling? Mama, I, I don't like when I'm, I'm insulted, though. Don't Is it not the truth? Me. Mama, stop that. Is it not the truth? You are calling uh, Stop calling me a gambler, Mama. If you are an adult, act like one. Behave like one. Mama, I have an important meeting. I will see you when I'm back. Okay. I'm not ready for the software. Okay. You don't know your brother. Make sure you don't do this. Make sure you don't do this. What am I doing? This is the what they said this idea. It's my phone. He leaves me cool. I see him. If anybody can come on it, those two. Hello? What do you want? <coughs> Madam Grace, please, I need to see you. Something came from but I need to talk with you. No, we cannot see Mrs. Carlo. As a matter of fact, I don't want you calling this number ever again. Why now? You think I don't know? I don't want to have anything to do with a woman who is shameless enough to kill her own husband because of another man. Please, don't call this line ever what? again. What? Hello? Hello? Hey! Hey! She's occupied. Let me call somebody else. Let me call Grace. Hello? Hello? Uh, Grace? Please. I need to see you. Who's this? Hello? It's me, Mrs. Carlo. Oh, I hear what you did to your family. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. No, no, wait! You have to hear from me! It's not the... This is what we have now. This is what we manage. Yeah? Until I find my feet. No, you mean that Madina and I want to go to school now? 
Who said that? Eva. I can't let that happen. I will not let that happen. You don't even have the money to pay for the school fees. Yeah, I know it's true, but I will do whatever I can to make sure that two of you get good education and become something in life. I promise you that. And, but this is where we have, this is where we will manage. Until I get something. Your uncle took everything. You have no money, no food, nothing. Even the phone that you used to sleep here, I borrowed it. So, better help us. Let us fix this place. Stop complaining. Harry, let's get the bags. Let us go to our house. Don't worry, I'm going Thank you. Thank you very much for a job well done. Huh? I feel awful. What do you mean by that? You feel awful? Why are you talking like this? For you to succeed in life as a man, you must not have a conscience. You have to kill your conscience. I don't have a conscience. And I don't care. Huh? Man, can I ask you a question? Ask me what? What do you want to gain from this? Chidebere, don't ask me stupid questions. You have done your job. What I owe you is your balance. It's none of your business. Take, take your money. Take this. You have no rights to judge me. You've done your job. I've given you your balance. Please leave. I'm afraid of... Please leave. Leave. And for your information, I don't want to hear this thing outside. You know you talk too much. I don't want to hear it outside. Go. Always behaving like a woman. What is even wrong? What do you want? We need to talk. About what? Okay. Don't give me much. What is all this? What is this? Hmm? Did you know I have what it takes to break you out of this ugly situation? And I'm willing to do it. Of course I know. You created the life. But why? Why? You know why? No, I don't. You don't. Okay? Let's assume you don't know my reason. Okay? But if you can do my bidding, I will save you and your daughters from this mess. Huh? I will turn things around for you. And what will this your bidding be? Did you why are you behaving like a child? Huh? You know I love you. I love you from the depth of my heart. Yeah. Sleep with me. Jesus Christ! I can't believe you just said that to me. Your late brother's wife. Did you leave that thing? Don't stop saying that. My brother is dead. My brother is in his grave. You keep on emphasizing on that. I met you before him, remember? You went ahead to spite me. Despite the love I had for you. So this is what this is all about. You killed my late husband and accused me of infidelity just because you wanted to sleep with me. Okay, be mindful of what you say. Mind what you say with your mouth before you put yourself in trouble. I will never disrespect the memory of my late husband by sleeping with his brother. I will never do that. I see you're stubborn. I see you're bent on ending up like this. I will help you succeed. I will make sure you suffer. I will make sure I deal with you. I will make sure you know no peace until you die. You want to die? I will help you die in Kajinga. Thank you. Thank you. Read my card. God, a man is deceitful and desperately wicked. Who can tell it? The heart of man is 
full of envy, hatred and strife, jealousy and love. They say that nothing lasts forever. This isn't true. Pass away. I didn't do much. I don't do much. I was like, oh, mommy, you're back. Welcome, mommy. Okay. I brought this prepared house. Okay, mom. This isn't the life I intended for them at all. How did things get to this point? Look at my children sleeping in an uncompleted building. And everyone I thought would come to our rescue believed the lies about me killing my dear Chikuzi. <laughs> we will not become a laughing stock. No. I refuse to accept defeat. I will go through. I always do. This is Scarlett. I just want to do if you have anything for me. I know. I received a message this evening. I have something, but the salary is not that much. What type of job is that? It's government work, sort of. Sweeping the street. Do you think you can? Please, I'm interested. I will do it. I will do it. The supervisor spoke to me about it last week. She said the person can start right away, so he can start tomorrow. Ah, thank you. Do you know how much the salary is? The salary is 50,000 naira every week. You can resume work by 7 a.m. every morning and close by 12 noon. 7 and close by 12 noon. I'm interested. I will do it. Thank um, you. I will give her a call now and get back to you. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. 15,000 every month. 15,000 every week. And I resume 7 and close at 12. That means I will still have more time to do another job if I get it. And let me even call Gladys. Let me see if she got my message. Hello, Gladys, this is uh, Mrs. Carly. Did you get my message? Yes, I did. And luckily for you, I have someone who is looking for a housekeeper. Oh, housekeeper? Yes, but the maid will be staying at the woman's house. The person will only come to her house to clean, sweep her compound, wash her clothes and toilet and then leave. Okay, do you have an um, idea when uh, I, uh, the person is supposed to resume? The person is to work for at least three hours every day and she can resume anytime from 11 a.m. Okay, what of the salary? It's not much, just 10,000 naira every week. I'm, I'm interested, thank you very much. <sighs> Okay, fine. The show by 12. Work for three hours. That means I still have time to do another job if I get it. <sighs> Let me call Patrick because I need as many jobs as possible. But these children's school fees are not fitting. Yeah? Let me call Patrick. What is it? 
It's mommy, she left us 500 naira to eat for both school. 500 naira? Who will 500 naira buy for three people? 500 naira is not enough for us. Why are you even acting as if you don't know the situation of things on ground? I don't understand. At least she left money for us to eat. Did she eat before going out? No. Then hey, can you drop 500? Hey, don't don't let me forget my hand or your face this morning. Don't try me. No. We don't become mates, Abby. Okay. Like, don't want to try. I'll come buy something for the room. You not buy your. Oh, bye bye. Mommy, how did you manage to get me jobs? <laughs> I spoke to some people in the church, and some of them decided to help. Oh, that's really good of them, man. That's so good. But it's working three jobs not too much for only you, mommy. My sisters and I can get jobs to support you, you know? No. I don't want you people to work. Hmm? They don't need any job. Okay? I need them to focus on getting good education and concentrate on graduating with flying colors for me. That way, when they now get decent jobs, they can help me in the training you in school. They don't need any job. If people should leave working for me, for now, hmm? I can do it. Yeah, mommy, mm. we promise you that we'll make you proud, okay? Mm. It's a promise, mommy. I know, I know. I adopt you. I know. But well, mommy, what about me? I'm not in school. I can work and support you now. I know. But you take care of the house for now. Your time will come. You know what? Your time will come. Oh? Okay. Oh. Um, Could I just see this, Joe? Ah, 
Como na água. De noite. <risos> Hello? <laughs> Bless you. What do you have? We have um, a possible. I want to see if we see with some more uh, gary and the jam. Then we have uh, jello fried, fried rice and uh, white rice. I don't want to swallow anything and eat heavy food. Uh, you said you have uh, fried rice? Yes, sir. Mm. Give me fried rice. What protein do you have? I have chicken and beef, sir. Mm. I don't do beef. White meat. So give me chicken. Okay, sir. And uh, make it snappy. Oh, yes, sir. I'm very sorry, sir. I'm very sorry, sir. I she didn't mean to. I apologize on her behalf. I 
hope this is for this one. She works extra hard. Let's just keep some for her to eat when she wakes up. She probably gets her mm -hmm. Probably. We are not sure. So let's just leave some for her. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Are you keeping all of this for Mm-hmm. Why? This is not enough for us. No. We will manage. Ah, what are you doing? We will manage. No, this one is not. What are you doing? We will manage as managers that we are, right? Don't try me. Sister Tomadina, stop it. What are you even doing? Leave this thing. Ah! Sister Tomadina, leave this thing! Hey, 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 hey. Oh! And that touches the floor. Uh-huh. Okay, so, so I'm not your mate, no, you're not challenging me. What is going on? Don't try me. Oh no. Oh, you put this thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Don't drop that thing. Are you okay? You're not challenging me now. You think I'm your mate? How can you come to your small sister like that? What is the problem, madam? Mama, I wanted to give food for you to eat when you wake up, but she's insisting that I will eat everything. Mommy, you have to eat. Mommy, will this one be enough for you? Let me leave it. Let me leave it. Sister Samantha, leave this in your body. Oh! Us to buy some textbook for the upcoming test, um, and, it's, and it's mandatory. How much is it? Then? It's ten thousand naira each. That means you need two. Yes, two. Is it mandatory? Yes. When is the deadline? Next week. Yeah. You will get it before that time. Thank you, mommy. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just need you to, to focus on your studies. I will make sure that every of your school needs will be taken care of. Mommy, I will promise you that we'll do our possible best to make sure we don't let you down. Me especially. I mm-hmm, promise. It's a promise. Mm-hmm. So, Mommy, how are you coping with juggling the multiple jobs she's doing? I'm juggling it now. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure you don't want me to get a job to support you? No, 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 no. You no, cannot no. keep carrying all the responsibilities on your shoulder. You need help, Mom. No. I just need you people to concentrate. I told you I have always handled it and I will handle it. Okay? And Come everything on. you saw, you were surely better. You don't deserve your mom. Why are you so loud? I see everything you do for us. Thank you. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
of the broken uh, bottle in, in his food, so even though I had nothing to do with it. I know you didn't, Mom. It's that wicked man. But really, why still come for your job after taking everything you and Daddy worked for from us? Eh? He wants to see us lose everything. It's not God, though. It's only God that can decide anyone's fate. He's not God. So what are you going to do now? Anyway, I have decided to use the money I saved for the three weeks I worked with her to rent the table so that uh, you'll be managing it while I continue with the two remaining jobs that I still have. That's what we'll do. That's a good idea, Mom. So what business do you have in mind? Just get ready to run out and show you. Let's hold up with this food so that these children can eat. I'm gonna sleep for it. Okay, mom. Yeah. Hello? Yes, she's oh, home. madam. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening. My man said you want to see me. Yes. My name is uh, Mr. Namde, Carlo. Namde, Carlo. Mm. Are you related to Mrs. Carlo? Exactly. He's my late brother's wife. And that's why I came to see you. Her husband is late. Oh, she didn't tell you? No. Mm. Ah, it's a long story, ma. Hmm? Madam, I have asked questions. And uh, from the information I got, you're a very good woman. And a decent one at that. So I decided to come and see you. Because uh, an elder does not sit at home while the goat delivers in theaters. Yeah. Uh, I heard you employed her and that she works for you. But the truth of the matter is that it is a very risky development. And I cannot sit back and watch that happen. And I don't want you to get into trouble. If you value your family, your life and your reputation. Sack Mrs. Carlo immediately. What do you mean? Madam, that woman is not what you think she is. She's a murderer, a thief, huh? an arm robber. That's what she is. I'm a family person. There, there's no reason for me to castigate her. I'm an insider. So whatever information I give to you is it. Your brother's wife? Yes. So whatever information I give you is a first-hand information. I don't want you to get into trouble. It's okay, I've heard you, Mr. Onamdi. Mm -hmm. You can take your leave now. Good. Madam. I have heard you, Mr. Onamdi. Believe whatever I told you. Believe me. 
don't regret this action letter. You can't employ a killer. Please. All right, see you. What kind of a man is this? Mrs. Carl, a thief? And it's fine. I will do my findings. I will. Buy something for that side that they come. I know they waste time. Make madam no come, come come back. I know they and they come. I kept it.
you don't go out. She don't do anything. You don't go out, ma'am. You are going to her house now. I don't tell. Oh my God! I you? was warned. I told me not to employ this woman. That she's a thief. Yeah. We are going to Mrs. Wait. Kalu's house now. Where did she carry? Go with me. No problem, ma'am. <sighs> about here, Amara. She's not a thief. <laughs> but they found the jewelry in her bag. Eh, but that doesn't mean she's the one that put them there. So if she'd not put it in her bag, then who did? I don't know. Uh, Mom is not a thief. That's what I know. Mm. She needs the money so I can understand. Mom is many things, but a thief is not one of them. Please stop. See, at this point, I don't even know what to believe in here. Uncle Nunamdi said that she's the one that killed daddy because daddy caught her cheating with another man. And you believe that liar? The man she had the affair with came to testify. Oh, oh. And today, they are accusing her of stealing jewelry. And you think you know how well? Oh my God. Both of you are unbelievable. Well, hmm. we can't leave mom at the police station now. Eh? So what are we going to do? Bring her out. <laughs> <laughs> eh, you have the money to do that, okay? I don't. Mm. But we have to look for money to bring mom out of that place. So, how and where do you hope that we we'll raise that money for? Amara, why are you asking this question? Because I want to know. Because you are the grand master planner. You said that she must not stay there. This and this and that. So definitely, you must have a plan to raise the money. So, Madam Bella, how are we going to raise the money? Well, we should ask some of our friends for help. <laughs> The same friends that cannot help her with accommodation. Ask her. 
It's the same friend you think they will come, they will come true for her. You think they will rescue her? <laughs> oh, we can't just stay here and okay. do nothing. We have to try. Adora, you are free to try all you want. But you see me, Amara, I am tired. I had a very, very tiring day. I want to rest. They could leave me alone. I've gone to everyone we know to see if they could raise the money for us. But no one was able to help my please. So what do you want me to do? My mother is not feeling too strong. A lucky her in that cell will make her health condition worse. This ma, if you can just take me her place and release her ma, please. When she pays you the money, you can release me, please ma. So if I release her, how do I get my money? How? She's a very hardworking woman. I know she will raise the money even though I know she didn't steal it. But please, ma, I beg you in the name of God, take me in place of her and release her, please, ma. Please. I see. So, this is where you live with your little criminals. I'm not surprised. Criminals live in uncompleted buildings. How did you find us? A little bird whispered into my ears. Huh? It told me you no longer work with your madam after you disgraced yourself by stealing from the poor woman. A thief. How did you know this? Why won't I know? I did not steal. You're still denying. That's how criminals behave. You were caught red-handed. And yet you're denying. Okay, what manner of woman are you? Eh? That's by the way. I'm back to business. Eh? Accept my proposal. And live a happy life. That's what, I'm, what, I, what I want. If the feeling is not mutual. The feeling is not mutual. Mm -mm. I don't love you. Because you look me in the eyes and tell me you don't love me. What is wrong with you? I met you first before my brother. You know I love you, yet you went ahead to marry him. Because I love him. This thing you feel for me, it's not mutual. I, I don't feel the same way for you. Ngechi, I feel love for you. Genuine love. You know I love you. All I'm asking is that you give me an opportunity. An opportunity to prove to you that I love you. I do not love you. And for crying out loud, for God's sake, you're a married man. Eh? I beg you, leave us alone. I'm married. Married men are sweeter. Give me a chance. Why are you like this? Why are you this wicked and stingy? My brother is in the grave. Hmm? He's rotting away and you are here. What are you doing with this? But I'll give it to me, Nkechi. You can't just be using it to urinate. You may say, oh, what is wrong with you? Huh? Let's enjoy life. Else, I will make life miserable for you. I will make life a living hell, I swear. Stop shedding crocodile tears. It will not touch me. You know, you know who I am. Hmm? I have conscience. But your tears will not move me because I know I am doing the right thing. Give it to me, Ed. Because do I have to beg for it? I will see you soon. Huh? And stop stealing.
of joy. I'm happy. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh. You're welcome. Oh, stop crying. It's okay, mommy. Oh, now that you people are back, what plans do you have? We made an arrangement with some of our friends during our service and they promised to get us decent jobs. That is very good. Yes, That's very right. good. <laughs> so, so Amara and I will be going there to live, to live with them. But where? In town. But why? Eh, uh, mommy, you know, she said that it will be easier that way. So that when companies and her friends call us, you know, we'll be there. And by the way, it's not as if the money is so much like that, you know, the distance from here to that place. Yeah, that's true, mm -hmm. because you're likely to be paying too much. Exactly. Mm -hmm. It's okay. So, oh, oh, when are you people leaving? Tomorrow. Huh? Yes. Already? Tomorrow. Yes. It's to okay. Leave. It's okay. Um, I'm just praying for you people to get these jobs so that you will come and help me. Send the brother to school. Adi, Adi. Look at the stage. <laughs> It's okay, don't worry, we'll get good jobs and then we will now move us out of this house. We'll get the bigger house. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We'll come back and take care of you. Trust you. Stop crying. I can't give up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For keeping them safe, all through the service, for providing for everything. Thank you. Thank you. Jesus. Thank you. Jesus. Mommy! <sighs> Mommy, you're crying. Why are you crying again? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> it's been four months. Four good months, Adora. And your sisters, we've not heard a word from them. What could be the reason for not trying to reach out to us? I really don't know, Mommy. What about my phone numbers? Still not going through. Something bad has happened to my children. Oh, Mommy, we don't know that for sure. So... If you are there, why would you not reach me? If your phone is working. <laughs> Mommy, I don't know. But we can't assume the worst. <laughs> Come on, Mommy. Stop, please. You need to stop crying. All right? I know my sisters are okay and they will come home when they are ready. <laughs> you think so? Yes, Mommy. We are the only family they have. So they will definitely come back home to us. Right? They are still probably trying to get good jobs. And you know how Sister Samadhan and Amara can be. If they haven't succeeded in making you proud, they wouldn't want to come back home. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Maybe you're right. Maybe I'm just overthinking. Yes, mommy. I am right. Good. Okay. Mommy, listen. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen. They know you are counting on them. All right? So if they haven't gotten the scent paying jobs, they wouldn't want to come back home and start telling you to be patient. Okay. It's okay, mommy. All right? Mm -hmm. It's okay. You are overthinking it. Okay. Just relax and trust that they will get good jobs. Come back home and take care of us, all right? It's okay, mommy. Please stop crying. It's all right. Okay. It's okay. You know, I don't like to see you cry. Do you want me to start crying too? It's okay, mommy. It's okay. Mission in one university in the north when you guys completed your work. Yes, my dear. Oh, they really missed you so much, you. They are number one best friend. Just left <laughs> them and went to the north. Um, look, <laughs> speaking of your sisters, mm -hmm. I met with Amara Jordan. You didn't tell me she's married. She's married and I'm a big lady. <laughs> are you married too? No, I'm not yet. Sure. Yeah. I didn't know my sister is married. She told me. I saw them some weeks ago. Even Samadina is also married. <laughs> to a wedding man. My dear. Lucky them. Oh my god. They caught big fish. They are really blessed. <laughs> My dear, not the only big fish your sister caught though. Yeah. Now where this one big? At this store. Ah. <laughs> You're really blessed. Yeah, thank God. Mm. Um, they are your best friends. I hope you've been to their house at least. My dear, look at that. The day I entered the mother house, Jesus, I nearly fainted. <laughs> See big house. Actually, we can stop. Jesus. <laughs> Actually, I'm even supposed to visit Aunt Samara tomorrow, but I lost my phone. Oh. Yes, so I can't even remember her house address. It's crazy. Ah, uh -uh. it's number 24 London Street now. Yes, that's it. Mm -hmm. Hey, no, no. How can I forget something like this at my age? <laughs> I am so ashamed of myself. It right happens, now. my dear. It happens. <laughs> nice to meet you again. Nice to meet you too. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't have to be. Mm. You're looking good though. You're not looking bad. <laughs> <laughs> hey, driver, I will drop there. Okay. <laughs> Both of them are married? Mm. Yes, mommy. Mm. I'm married. Mm. And Soma got married without telling me. How is that possible? Who gets married without telling their families? Soma. And Amara got married without telling their mother. So, who did their husbands make in breakfast? Adora, I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I wish I can say the same, mommy. Are you telling me that you believe your sisters are married? <sighs> there is only one way to find out. I collected Amara's address. So I'll go there tomorrow and see for myself.
Hello? What? Jesus Christ, when? Who was between she and? Okay, thank, thank you so much. I'm going there right away. Thank you. Jesus Christ, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. This way. Look at her. Mommy. You need to go back to your sister's house again. What? Yes. They need to know about my condition. Biko. Mommy, you think they will care? They need to know about the surgery. They are married to wealthy husbands. Their husbands can sponsor this surgery. I just want my legs again. I want to walk, Andorra. You can never break me. You won't break me. Fine. I'll go back there this afternoon after lunch. Okay. Thank you. I'm still here. Thank you. Thank you. Mommy, no, no, no. Please, 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 don't cry. Please. Alright, let me just go and arrange something for us to have for lunch, alright? And the betrayer of a loved one. Be good. Some people give you all for They come your back on you. It's a shame how you choose to believe all the lies that they told you believe them. And then you walked away, you walked away from me. They said that nothing lasts forever. This season two will pass away. And I will keep on holding on until the end. All your evil will come to light. And your deceit will come to light. This woman. Please, I need to talk to her. It's important. I'm sorry, I've told you. I'm just following instructions. The last time you came here, I almost lost my job. Please. Can you at least help me pass a message across to her? Tell her that her mother was involved in an accident and left her on a wheelchair. For her to walk again, she will need a surgery. If she can let me in, I will give her the complete details. Please, tell her I'm waiting for her response. Okay, I'm helping her. Please, I don't want to lose my just just be gone. Break me. Hey, yes, I'm still here. 
waited there the whole day, mommy, thinking she would send her git man to let me in. But she didn't. Did, did you tell the git man about my accident and my surgery? Yes, mommy. I sent a message across to her through her git man. But I didn't get any response from Amara. They said nothing hurts more. And the betrayer of a loved one. Please, please. Some people give you all for. They don't do back from you. It's a shame how you choose to believe. I'm okay. Let me wash my hand. Please, drink water first. To wash my hand. Let me drink water first, please. Please, have some. I'm okay. Adora, let me wash my hand. You and Samadina left mommy and I four months ago with the promise that you will come back when you get decent paying jobs. Along the line, you both got married to, to rich men and didn't have the decency to tell mommy about it? Adora, you came all the way here to give me history lessons. Huh? You didn't think mommy deserves to know about your new lives? Oh, no, I did not. I mean, Soma and I got married to big fishes. You expect us to be related to a woman that has such a terrible past? What do you mean, terrible past? You have forgotten so soon. Adora, people are still talking about this thing. You forgot how daddy found out that she was cheating on him? And she killed daddy because he found out. Eh? Christ. Nico, 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 Nico. I cannot be associated with a woman that has such a life. Please don't ruin my business for me. Amara, after everything mommy went through, to give you and Samadina the life she never had. <laughs> well, nobody asked her to give birth to what are we even talking about? She owed us everything, if not more. This is how you justify your cruelty towards a woman that bled to make sure you and Samadina went to school to become somebody in life. That woman is sick. She can't walk. She needs more of you. She needs you, Amara. She needs more of you. Adora. I believe this conversation is over. Huh? I have some very important guests I'm attending to inside. Take care of yourself. They say nothing hurts more than the betrayer of a loved one. Some people you give your all for. They turn their backs on you. It's a shame how you choose to believe all the lies that they told you believe them. And then you walked away. Walked away from me. They said that nothing lasts forever. This season two will pass away. And I will keep on holding on until the end. All your evil will come to light. And your deceit will come to light. Honestly, there is something I'm not getting here. Why would they do that kind of a thing to you? Hmm. After all that you suffered for them? They had always believed that mommy is guilty of Uncle Namde's accusation. According to Somadina, rumors like that can ruin their marriage. So they just separated themselves from mommy and I. Excuse you? That's the lamest excuse I've ever heard in my lifetime. So, what did that happen to Uncle Namde? All your evil will come to light And your deceit too will come to light And everything you saw You will surely bear You can never break me 
Honestly, he got what he deserved. Mm. <sighs> Obin. Mama. After I told me he proposed to her and she refused. And I am yet to know why. I was scared. Confused. Because of my mother's experience. And also because I don't know what will happen if I say yes and get married. My mother is bound on a wheelchair. I do many old jobs to pay our rent and feed us. And you, Obina, you are just a driver. I don't know, I, I, I don't know how we could start a family when both of us are still struggling to stand on our feet. I... Wait, wait, wait. Adora, you may need to turn down my proposal because we are not financially stable? Yes, it's part of it. Not because you don't love me? I love you more than you can imagine, Obi. I just don't think it's wise for us to, to get married now. Maybe in the next one or two years, when we must have been financially stable. But for now... Um... Ada, I am sorry uh, that I haven't been completely honest with you. What do you mean? I am not a driver. Ada, I don't work for any boss. <laughs> but the car, the, the mansion... They are all mine. Yes. I'm sorry, what? How, 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 why did you lie about working for some rich man? I, I will tell you. It was because of my past experience with a woman I thought was mine. Little did I know that she was with me because of what I have. But one day, I still feel the guilt till today. Oh my mm. god. <laughs> Don't worry. Obi, I am so sorry about your mom. It's fine. <sighs> oh my god. Adora. I ask again. Will you make me part of this family? I promise to love you and cherish Mama like my own mother. Although she she's taking me like her son already. Mm. Please. Yes, Obi. I will marry you. Thank you. Come here. <laughs> 
Came to testify against you. Against what? <clears throat> what do you want? In fact, I've been looking for you girls and your mother ever since that day. Why? What for? Um, to right my wrongs. What do you mean by right your wrongs? It don't make sense to me. Whatever I said that day, it was your uncle that paid me to say all of them. It. So you mean you were lying? Why would you do anything like that? Please, I am sorry. Because he persuaded me to say all the things that I said that day. Honestly speaking, I have been, I have been having a sleepless night. I don't walk around freely. My conscience has been beating me. Your conscience is supposed to tie your neck and squeeze it off. Because I am a people man. Do you know the magnitude of what you did? Do you know how you stigmatized my mother? Nobody was that related to our family as a person of what you did. Who wants us to see them come to the one that killed her? I want to for another man. Who? I am ready to do anything. That's why I am begging you, please. I am so sorry. I am ready to do anything that would make everything go on well. Please, I am sorry. I am sorry, honestly. Sachi Debe, I'm sorry. Go to hell. What? And suffer for your sins. Evil please, man. I'm... Get up! Oh, Mama, it's fine. Um, I want my coming into your family to bring genuine reconciliation between you and your daughters. I know you've been through a lot in their hands. I know how you feel. After all your sacrifices in them, and they disappointed you when you needed them most. But, please, please, I want you to genuinely forgive them from your heart. And I, I will do anything within my powers to make sure you smile again. Mm -hmm. Mama, it's fine, it's okay. <laughs> look at your daughter. At least look at her daughter, my wife. We we'll have a wedding to plan. Therefore, we need them. Please, please, find it in your heart to forgive them. Biko, oh? Sorry. Mama. What you are asking me to do? What you are asking me to do? What you are asking me to do is very difficult. I know. It's very difficult. Oh, God. Ah. It's too hard for me to accept. <laughs> it's too hard for me to accept. I know. I mean, I so bad. I so bad for this children. I so bad. Oh. I mean, I cannot. I cannot. I can't even think about my children and my children again. I don't want to have anything to do with them. This is the only child I have. I don't know. I don't know. the only child I have. Leave me. I don't want to have anything to do with it. <laughs> Mommy, please. Please, please, please. Please, you have to try. Okay? They have shown genuine remorse for their actions. Them coming here with their husbands to apologize is enough reason for you to forgive them. They are, st they are still your children. No matter what. Okay. <laughs> Try. You did Mama. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You've cried enough. Okay. okay. Mama. Remember you're a Christian mother. Also remember what the Bible says. To err is human. And to forgive, and to forgive is divine. divine. 
Okay. 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 It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Please. It's okay. It's okay. Um, honey, please, can you just go in there and get some water for Mama? Please. It's okay, Mama. Please. It's okay. We've cried a lot. Don't you? It's okay. Just relax. Like I said before, I'll make sure you smile with me. Okay? That's my word to you. They said I'd nothing left for us. Everything you saw, you were surely 